Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to the Edgar O world. Welcome back to my humble little place. So in today's video, it's gonna be a really exciting one. It's going to be a really fun one because I just recently got some fun and exciting things in the mail. And by fun and exciting things, I do mean check it out, of course. This is gonna be an unboxing slash review video, more so a review video because we're actually gonna be taking a closer look at the dolls. And I actually got them right here. As you can see, they do come in two really big boxes and I really can't wait to open them, especially this one. I know what's in here and I know what's in here. I haven't yet opened it, as always. I've been trying to like keep my composure and not open it and just look at it. I really just wanted to get on camera and see it for the first time with you guys because this is really exciting for me. Okay, I'm seriously about to block this Chucky portrait right here because it's like focusing on this rather than focusing on my face and that's really annoying so if this changes in a bit it's because of that but anyways so last year i made a video called new chucky merchandise or new chucky products that were coming out actually this year from mesco toys and trigger tree studios and if you are a true chucky fan like myself then you know that in a couple of weeks we're gonna be getting the trigger tree studios good guy doll and whew, that is the most anticipated doll of like the season like I really cannot wait till it arrives in my doorstep and I have it in my hands and of course I'm gonna be getting in front of the camera and I'm gonna be doing an unboxing for you guys but oh my god I really cannot wait for that moment that's literally gonna be the coolest freaking doll Ever. But in the meantime, in today's video, we're going to be doing two unboxing Chucky dolls. One of them is called, I think, a Pizza Slice Face Chucky doll. And the other one is the Jack in the Box Chucky doll, or I should say, the Burst a Box Chucky doll. And honestly, I'm really, really excited. So let's say no more. Let's jump right into the video and let's review these Chucky dolls. All right, so the first one I'm going to start off with is the big box. And obviously, from the look of the box, I know what's in here. This is the Burst a Box Chucky doll. And this is one that I'm really excited for because we haven't seen anything like this. This is something different and unique. So let's open him up and let's see what he looks like. Gotta be careful. Moment of truth. This is always the most exciting part when you're about to just open it. Okay, shut up and open it. Okay, so the first thing you see is this. Very well packed. Oh my god. Are you ready? Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> what is this? What is this? This is freaking... This is freaking awesome. What? Okay, I love 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 the box the box actually feels really thick compared to their other boxes wow and this is from masco toys i like the art design in the box it's actually really pretty cool okay so i'm not trying to nitpick but i'm kind of over the blood dripping in the black boxes but anyways that doesn't really matter it's the product that matters and wow this this guy looks really super cool. Wow, I gotta say, I am really impressed with this. He does look a little funny without the hands, but I am really not mad at this. This is... <sighs> Stop! Like, this is... This is worth it. So you could get this little guy from Mesco Toys. He is, I believe, $49.99, plus shipping was like $14. Honestly, looking at it right now, the size and the quality of the packaging and how it really looks, I gotta say, it's definitely worth it. I'm really curious to see what music or what is it gonna say when you do the little handle. So we're gonna open this up and we're gonna review it and just pretty much take a look at all of that. So, but before we jump into that, we're gonna open the other box and we're gonna take a closer look at the other check it out. All right, so right here we have the next one. As you can see, this is the other one, the, I, what it, why is it called pie? No, Pizza Slice Face, right? Was that a quote from the movie? But anyways, this is from Child's Play 3 where he gets his face sliced in half. And yeah, let's open it up and see how it looks. Yeah, you gotta be really careful with this because imagine you cut the, the actual product. <sighs> Tragedy. Okay, 
Moment of truth. <gasps> I see it in the monitor. <laughs> oh, Christmas all over again. Wow. Holy crap. Are you kidding me? Stop. This is just... Oh, this is so satisfying. Like, I really like this like this is freaking awesome all right so here it is the child's play 3 chucky doll and this is also from mesco toys yep and wow i have no words to how awesome this really really looks in person but once again i'm not trying to be a nitpick and a party pooper but can we please get rid of this or like can we just make a removable sticker because i don't i don't like this i feel like this kills the whole purpose of the packaging this is just my personal opinion I don't like this but anyways that's just a personal taste the dolls obviously freaking awesome um as you can see it talks it does say a couple of phrases and we're actually gonna be looking at what it says this is a bomb bomb ass photo shoot so whoever's doing the artwork at Trick or Treat Studios are doing a hell of a good job and let's let's press what it says I'm new and improve, okay. Okay, so from the looks of it, he's on tried mode because he's only saying two phrases. I hope he says more than two phrases. It says he comes complete with a gun that fits neatly into his right hand. But yeah, this this is definitely a really cool collectible. I like this is just incredible. I gotta say, if you're thinking about getting this and you're not sure, I say go for it because this is freaking cool. And I just noticed this side is like the good guy doll box, but this side is more like what it looks like but yeah this is the talking pizza face chucky and we're gonna open it and we're gonna see what other things does it say but yeah let's jump into the burst of box and let's see how it looks let's see what it says because i'm really really curious about that one all right so i have it right in front of me i'm gonna open it you know i really hate opening my chucky dolls because i feel like once you open them it loses its value I don't know, maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm just overthinking it like a collector does. All right, so we're gonna take it out of the box. As you can see, he does come very well secure. Oh my God. <laughs> Even better looking in, out of its box, to be honest with you. I almost feel like buying two more of these just so I can have one in its box, one out like this, and then the other one just like closed in the box this is freaking cool like this is this is neat this is definitely gonna be a collectible in the long run you know what would have been so cool if this was the actual jack-in-the-box from child's play 2 the trailer and the poster but probably because of legal issues they probably weren't able to do that but anyways let's hide this little guy and let's make him pop and see what it does all right so here we go Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you. I was not expecting that song, the original song from Jack in the Box. I thought it would be like him saying something or the music from Child's Play, but I get it. It's a Jack in the Box, so it was gonna have that song. I gotta say, I am so obsessed with this. I almost just wanna prop it somewhere up there with the rest of the Chucky dolls. I'm true to leaving it in its box, so this is really why I wanna buy two more so I can have three in total and just prop them up like that. But anyways, what are your thoughts on this specific toy? Because my thoughts are this is incredible. The paint job on this is just amazing. Like I really think they did a hell of a job for this and for the price, you know what? It's 10 times worth it. This is worth your money. This is what you call money well spent. Now that I'm done bragging about this piece of art, Let's jump into the piece of Chucky face and let's see what else that Chucky doll says. This is pretty cool, right? Here. I like it a lot. All right, so now let's open this one. This is the talking pizza face Chucky doll. I'm really curious to know what else he says. Wow. So he does come with his little instructional book, which I don't really need. He only comes with a gun. I guess the purpose of that is because that's pretty much what he uses in that movie i'm sorry child's play 3 is not really one of my favorite ones all right let me unbutton him from back here oh he's really stuck oh my god i appreciate that they're trying to keep him in place but damn okay masco toys for real like for real 
Okay. About time. About time. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. I hate these things. Okay, give me one minute. This is gonna take some time. Oh my god. I'm very impatient for stuff like this. Can we just cut it with the scissors? Because this is so annoying. I can't. I gotta cut this. I can't. <sighs> Five years later. Alright, so this is what the little fella looks like. And we're gonna press the button and see what else he says. Hi, I'm Chucky. And I'm your friend to the end. Heidi Ho. <laughs> oh, I love that. I freaking love that. Oh, thank you for adding that. I am so glad they added that to this one. That's a good one. So, uh, what's your name, kid? Oh, that's a good one. I'm new and improved. Okay, we heard that one. My real name is Charles Lee Ray. Bomb. A long time no see, pal. Pretty dope. Man, I really gotta get out of this body. Iconic. Alright, so he does say seven different phrases, and honestly, I, I love it. Those are seven different phrases that are very iconic to the movie, especially the good guy one. Honestly, can you imagine Mesco Toys coming out with a life size of this guy right here? Iconic. He also does come with a little gun that you could post in his hand. I love the fact that it stays in his hand. It won't fall. It's really, really in there. And that is, this is just so freaking cool. I like the way the hands move. You could prop them, you could pulse them. Um, they do move, they do turn, even the wrists. Like This is definitely what you call stepping your game up. All right, so to be honest with you, I think this has become officially my new favorite one from the Mesco Toys collection. From all the Chucky dolls that they have come up with, this is definitely probably my favorite one. I really hope Mesco Toys continues to make more Chucky dolls because they do a hell of a good job with them and I like the details like especially on the bottom of the shoe it has the good guy logo and this is this is so freaking awesome. I, I'm really happy with this Chucky doll too. But yes I am obsessed. I am in love with these two Chucky dolls and Mesco Toys have been really stepping their Chucky game up and I'm all in. But anyways, that is pretty much it for today's video and I would really want to know your thoughts, feelings, and emotions towards these Chucky dolls. What do you think about them? Also, don't forget that if you like this video, please give me a huge thumbs up because that lets me know that I should continue to make more videos like this for us. Chucky fans. Also, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscriber button and join the Chucky family. Also, don't forget to click that bell button to get notified for every single time I upload. But alright guys, as always, thank you for watching and I will see you on my next video. Bye! And I was expecting it too. <laughs> Stupid!